cardiovascular system, it's very simple. It's a number three, heart blood vessels and lymph vessels. As a variant number three, it's a heart, uh, artery and vein. Uh, third variant number three, it's a heart, uh, vessels and blood. Blood vessels are divided into arteries. Uh, it's uh, transfer blood from the heart and uh, veins, transfer blood to the heart. Lymphatic vessels uh, carry the lymph to the left and uh, right vein uh, corner. Um, different schematics for understand uh, big and uh, small or uh, pulmonary uh, capillary uh, circulation. And uh, main reason in this is schematic, for example, it's a uh, must be present lymph capillaries and uh, next uh, lymph flow to the lymph node. Uh, after this, uh, um, we, uh, lymph vessels and moving uh, all lymph uh, connecting with venous blood. As a result, it's an uh, ending point uh, uh, right atrium. A uh, very important moment, it's a um, um, microcirculatory bed. Microcirculatory bed, for example, uh, very good if you remember uh, artery and veins, it's a not part of the uh, microcirculatory uh, bed because only arterial, next uh, precapillar, uh, capillary, uh, capillaries, uh, postcapillar, and uh, uh, venal. It's a part of the hemomicrocirculatory bed. If present a lymph capillary, lymph, uh, uh, it uh, will be microcirculatory bed. And microcirculatory bed consists of this gamma microcirculatory bed and lympho microcirculatory bed. And uh, some uh, distribution of the extra organ arteries. First of all, arteries are located on the way of the nerve tube and nerves. For example, if uh, we uh, can see to the picture with uh, artery uh, with nerves of the upper limb, uh, you understand uh, here in this is uh, sulcus uh, must be present big portion vein. Uh, next, uh, arteries are divided into parietal and visceral. Uh, uh, you remember, for example, different cavities of the uh, our body uh, consist with um, include uh, internal organs and uh, for example in abdominal cavity uh, parietal uh, branches of the abdominal aorta consist of with uh, walls uh, of the uh, abdominal uh, or as a variant abdominal pelvic cavity yes and uh, Visceral uh, artery in a different cavity, it's a to the visceral organ uh, or organs, these uh, parts. Uh, next, uh, each extremity gets uh, one main trunk. Uh, for example, uh, you understand uh, subclavian artery, next axillary artery, brachial artery, uh, uh, and in uh, antibrachy, ulnar, uh, radial artery, and uh, this artery meeting in a uh, palm, and uh, connecting to this is uh, artery uh, with arch uh, superficial and deep, with different branches in, as a result. At the moment, it's uh, major arteries in a uh, lower limb, uh, for example, uh, external iliac artery, next uh, femoral artery, popliteal artery, tibial anterior, and other to the foot. Arteries uh, as a trunk save the segment structure. Um, and uh, next, most uh, of the arteries are uh, distributed as parietal arteries of the soma and visceral. Uh, here, for example, uh, it's a 
um, intercostal artery, posterior intercostal artery, and uh, present anterior intercostal artery. It's artery uh, 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 together with uh, vein and intercostal nerve located in the south of so the ribs uh, in uh, of the uh, mm, internal uh, surface of the ribs. Arteries to go uh, go together with uh, with veins and the lymphatic vessels, forming the common vessels complex. Uh, for example, it's a, a standard uh, standard variant. It's a triad. Yes, nerve, uh, artery, and vein. Uh, for example, uh, here it's a veno uh, uh, vasorum lacun. Lacuna vasorum uh, or lake uh, where located this is structure. Uh, regulatory uh, uh, regularities of the arteries allocation. Uh, first of all, arteries choose the shortest way to move to the organ. For example, its rules are really um, um, for kidney. Uh, very short uh, way uh, and in uh, same with uh, short uh, and uh, right line uh, in a perpendicular yes, uh, to the uh, kidney. Next, arteries are located on the uh, flexor surfaces of the body. Arteries are located in the grooves and canal formed by bones, muscles, facets which protect blood vessels from uh, compression. Arteries uh, enter the organ on uh, its concave medial surface, which face the blood supply. For example, uh, you remember uh, porte hepatis, uh, helium uh, renalis, uh, and uh, all uh, organs with parenchymal uh, structures have some uh, a special place where moving vessels and uh, some tubular organ, for example, it's a ureter in a kidney. Arteries from um, devices according to the function of the body, uh, vascular networks, uh, rings, and uh, accurate anastomosis are formed in the organs associated with movements. Um, um, Next, uh, the ca caliber of the arteries is determined uh, not only by size of the organs, but also its function. Uh, due to uh, the later, uh, the endocrine glands have numerous power uh, surge. It's, for example, uh, thyroid glands have uh, three thyroid uh, arteries, superior, inferior, and thyroid uh, ema and uh, full same with pancreas with big portion arteries and veins for vascularization this is organ next uh, which organs here it's a hypophysis and uh, cycle of the villisius uh, it's a, a special uh, cycle for vascularization this organ too uh, and um, some Mm, uh, the wall uh, of an adult artery consists of three mem uh, membranes, internal, medium, and external. It's very important too. In, uh, in the blood uh, vessels, in the capillary and other structure, main uh, first of all, uh, the inner shell, Tunica intima is formed by a layer of endothelial cells, uh, a subendothelial layer, and a basement uh, membrane. This is uh, layers here, for example, tunica interna with a special structure, um, endothelium, fenestral endothelium. Next, uh, it's uh, elastic tissue. Uh, you understand. Uh, tunica media uh, or tunica muscularis and tunica externa too. Uh, in a um, capillary part, uh, you understand that the telium have a special structure. It's some information with uh, histology, but it's very important 
who understand its uh, endothelium, this endothelium uh, uh, changing uh, if uh, present some influence uh, difference uh, toxin, for example, and other uh, two. The middle membrane tunica media formed a circular uh, fib fibers of uh, unstrated muscle tissue and uh, elastic fibers. Next, uh, outer uh, shell or tunica uh, externa contains loose connective tissue with vascular uh, vessels, vasovasorum, and uh, vascular nerves. Nervivasorum for vessels, uh, vasovasorum, nervivasorum for nerves. For example, it's a nervi nervorum and vasa nervorum uh, for uh, vascularization innervation. Inner and outer elastic membranes, membrana elastica interna and membrana elastica externa, are placed between the shells. And it's a, in a histology structure, uh, some layers. It's, a, for example, uh, vessels, uh, arterial vessels, uh, middle cal caliber, and uh, differences between, for example, artery and vein, uh, big portion uh, valve present, for example, in a lower limb, uh, to the large arteries, uh, the aorta and uh, its large branches are arteries of the elastic type because uh, their walls uh, are dominated by elastic fibrous and membrane. Um, the artery of medium and small uh, caliber a determinated but muscular elements, artery of the muscular type, uh, the uh, contractile function of uh, which helps uh, the further movement uh, of blood uh, to uh, periphery. In arteries of muscular elastic mix type, uh, there are uh, almost the same number of uh, muscle cell and elastic fibers in the middle membrane, for example, subclavian and femoral arteries. Uh, subclavian artery here, for example, consists of these three parts uh, in a different um, uh, structure, in a different cavity uh, connecting with scalenous uh, muscle. For example, here uh, you can look, you can see um are uh, arteria uh, iliaca externa after ligament inguinal uh, ligament uh, it's uh, next uh, femoral artery and in a canalis adductoris uh, changing this is named a femoral artery to the popliteal uh, popliteal artery and moving to the next part of the lower limb by the nature of the branches, uh, the arteries are uh, distinguished uh, by the main type of branches, loose and mixed type of branches. According to the main types of branches, uh, the lateral branches de depart from the well definite main trunk of the artery. For example, the superior mesenteric artery, superior mesenteric artery here, for example. Um, and according to the uh, place or type, uh, the artery is initially uh, di divided into terminal branches, for example, the internal iliac artery. Um, internal iliac artery um, is, uh, dilated to the different branches um, in the finish too. Uh, the vessels that provide blood flow uh, by passing uh, the main pathway is called collateral vessel. Collateral vessel uh, the, uh, or vas collateral. Uh, the vessels that connect uh, the lateral branches of one arterial trunk of uh, different trunk of main vessels is called anastomotic vessels or vasa anastomotica. In uh, accordance uh, with this, uh, there are intrasystemic uh, in a one system, yeah? Intrasystemic anastomosis, for example, the Hutchinko-Wellenburg cycle, and uh, intersystemic anastomosis, for example, with Willisian 
cycle. The Lysian cycle uh, here, for example, uh, it's a, a cycle of the Lysius where uh, connecting um, anterior cerebral artery, uh, media cerebral artery, and posterior cerebral artery. And you understand uh, present communicants posterior, uh, communicants uh, with uh, anterior uh, and uh, communicants media uh, artery within the cis vessels and as a result it's a big portion vascularization of the hypothesis next uh, for example uh, the Hutchinko wellenberg uh, cycle it's here where uh, meeting two vertebral uh, artery and um, yeah, star team, uh, as a result, this is a cycle. It's an um, anterior spi uh, spinal artery to the spinal cord. Artery and veins is very uh, variable with uh, structure, uh, which should be uh, considered in the clinic. Uh, if I really speak about some variants and anomalies, it's a big portion in the uh, vessels, for example. And some variant for a membrane, it's a drawing and created some schematic, for example. You can look, uh, you can see it's here uh, in the left ventricle certain aorta, ascending arch of aorta, descending part, uh, thoracic part, and in the arch, uh, aortic arch, uh, starting three vessels, brachiocephalic trunk, uh, left common uh, uh, carotid, and uh, uh, thoracic aorta, yes, uh, and uh, different as a method uh, in a different region, uh, you can uh, um, create this schematic for remembering. And uh, role of the circulatory system in a different system, yeah, digestive, endocrine, integument, lymphatic, muscular, muscular, it's a big portion information. And uh, very good if you will uh, find some um, variant, for example, for the digestive system, absorbs nutrient and water, uh, delivered nutrients, expect most uh, lipid, lipids uh, to liver for uh, processing by hepatic portal vein, provides nutrients essential uh, for hematopoiesis and uh, building or hemoglobin. And for all system have uh, present role of the circulatory system and for all system in our body, it's uh, very important. It's a vascularization. Uh, without vascular vascularization, innervation, structure and function, some uh, organs, uh, it may uh, present some problem. And uh, it's a places where can touch and stop some uh, mm, crush vessels and when present bleeding uh, and uh, here variant uh, it's a skin uh, after skin it's a big portion uh, venous uh, mm, capillary and ven veins uh, superficial uh, subcutaneous yes next uh, variant it's a deeper uh, uh, present uh, near muscle muscles, a big portion fascia, and in the fascia, uh, in a different sulcus, uh, uh, present uh, big portion vessels, arterial venous. Uh, in the um, skull, it's a sinuses, uh, sinuses for moving of uh, venous blood with uh, skull uh, brain, yes, with uh, internal. Uh, structure of the uh, cranial cavity. Uh, big portion of veins and arteries located in the head and neck, and uh, big portion of different branches. Uh, next, uh, um, plexus uh, in the mucous membrane, uh, in the uh, branches to the different organs. Uh, and venous valves, venous valves in a different uh, region. It's very important too for veins. And um, 
different schematic different schematics uh, are very good for remembering some uh, region and some branches of different uh, organs for example we know uh, sinuses in a dura mater uh, starting in internal jugular vein in a jugular opening or foramenibular uh, in a region where um, present uh, subclavian vein in brachiocephalic vein here Vena subclavia and vena jugularis interna, uh, as a result, uh, meeting these two vessels, uh, starting brachiocephalic vein uh, uh, here, right, and uh, left to uh, internal jugular vein, subclavian vein, meeting and uh, consist of, of the brachiocephalic vein. Together, two brachiocephalic vein, uh, it's uh, as a result, um, consist of uh, vena cava superior. Uh, so uh, very important, uh, it's uh, uh, some variant when you can uh, replay information about liver. Uh, it's some structure, venous ligament, for example, uh, some um, uh, teres, uh, hepatis uh, ligament. It's a structure in the em em embryogenesis uh, uh, was some uh, vessels too. And uh, totally, if we uh, visualization of vessels, artery and vein, some uh, and general, uh, generally uh, have uh, same vision, but uh, if we uh, can see to the uh, limbs, yes, it's the biggest, uh, for example, one R3 uh, moving with two uh, veins and other. Uh, next, uh, um, it's a uh, one uh, different uh, structure um, in the uh, venous uh, vessels uh, and connecting between two uh, bassin. First of all, vena cava uh, superior, vena cava inferior, and vena porta hepatis. And uh, in this picture, for example, very good visualization, some anastomotic with uh, this is vein. And here, for example, uh, function muscles uh, when present uh, flex uh, some movie of the muscles. It's uh, uh, some um, uh, method for uh, moving uh, better to heart some ven venous blood too. And differences between uh, venous uh, cir uh, circuit and uh, arterial. Uh, in a different region, uh, you understand in the venous, it's a uh, uh, walls uh, uh, sink, uh, more uh, layers and more structure present in the arterial uh, too, uh, and uh, some variant for uh, location, different vessel, for example, artery, veins of the femoral region. It's uh, in a different, uh, different uh, topography uh, structure, for example, uh, trigonum, uh, femoral trigonum, and uh, in uh, this is structure in, uh, uh, for example, uh, lower limb present big personal nerves too. Uh, here, uh, to some structure uh, in the vessels. Next, uh, it's a um, lymphatic system uh, definition. But first of all, in a lymph, uh, lymphatic system, it's a uh, pathogens. Uh, pathogens in a lymph, a present uh, and uh, it's an organism that causes disease. Lymphatic system, cells, tissue, and organs uh, that play a central role in the body. Uh, defenses again uh, against pathogens. Uh, next, lymphatic vessels consist of uh, vessels lymphatics uh, failed by uh, lymph. Uh, connected to lymphatic organs and uh, components of the lymphatic system. It's a uh, 
tonsils, lymphatic vessels, lymph nodes, uh, thoracic duct, for example, yes, and uh, function of the lymphatic system, it's a produced, uh, maintain, uh, distribute a lymphocyte, uh, lymphocyte attacked, uh, you know, invading organism, abnormal cells, foreign proteins, uh, maintain blood volume, uh, help uh, eliminate uh, local variation in uh, interstitial uh, fluid uh, concentration. And uh, you remember lymphatic uh, capillary, it's a lymph for microcirculatory uh, micro bed consists with a gamma microcirculatory bed and together it's a microcirculatory bed. Uh, lymphatic uh, capillaries with lymphatic valve too, lymphatic uh, vessels and uh, main picture uh, as a result. Uh, this information please uh, create in some form for drainating of right uh, lymphatic duct, uh, right lymphatic duct. Um, it's a finish uh, in a venous angle right. Uh, venous angle, it's a place where I'm meeting uh, uh, internal uh, jugular vein with uh, right uh, subclavian vein. And uh, this uh, angle, uh, venous angle, uh, where we'll be moving all lymph with right part of the head, right part neck, uh, right part of the uh, thoracic uh, or chest, and uh, right uh, upper limb. All uh, other lymph uh, uh, drainage to thoracic duct. Thoracic duct here, in the, uh, thoracic duct, it's a long structure. Uh, during uh, vertebral clam and starting in a abdominal cavity and uh, to the in, uh, point where present uh, sternohili moving lymph to the uh, this region with uh, a lower limb with abdominal uh, uh, pelvic cavity with uh, next moving this is uh, thoracic duct uh, left lymphatic yes um, in a uh, chest uh, uh, thoracic cavity and uh, all uh, limb drainage uh, too and with uh, left uh, part of the uh, head, neck and uh, left uh, upper limb. And in, as a result in the venous angle uh, left uh, moving thoracic duct and all lymph with uh, this is green color yes uh, moving to this uh, region as a result all lymph uh, moving between right and left brachiocephalic vein to the vena cava superior lymphocyte uh, life uh, cycle uh, consistently migrate between lymphoid tissue and blood on, and the blood uh, pro uh, production and development called the lymphopoiesis uh, involves bone marrow, thymus, uh, peripheral lymphoid tissue. And uh, for example, uh, to the lymph organs, uh, it's uh, tonsils. And you remember in a um, uh, pharynx present pharyngeal tonsil in the upper uh, wall, it's an anterior tonsil. Anterior tonsil, it's a two lingual tonsil in a uh, radix of the uh, radix of the uh, tongue, and uh, pear tonsil, it's uh, palatine tonsil and tuba tu tubaria uh, tonsil uh, uh, near uh, tubarian tube and uh, near uh, after palatine. Yes, palatine tonsil located in the right left. And uh, together it's uh, six uh, tonsil in the oral cavity and nasal cavity or in a, a region where located uh, nasopharynx and oropharynx. Lymphoid organs, important lymphoid organs include lymph nodes, thymus, spleen, located in uh, areas that are vulnerable uh, to pathogens. Uh, lymph nodes, uh, lymph nodes, uh, and the encapsulated mice 
encapsulated masses uh, of lymphoid tissue contains lymphocyte, monitor and filter uh, lymph, uh, remove antigens and initiated immune response. Um, capsule of the uh, lymphatic uh, no, uh, lymph nodes uh, very important uh, to the lymph uh, node may present some uh, variant not one uh, two or three or four afferent lymphatic vessels with lymph with different organs but uh, in this is lymph may present antigens after filtration if the uh, on the lymph uh, nodes um, one efferent lymphatic vessels uh, uh, must be present uh, absent antigens, pathogens, viruses, because this is uh, lymph uh, will be moving to the um, venous angle as a result uh, connected with venous blood. Thymus uh, lies uh, behind sternum, a T cell divided and uh, material zero. Uh, strings after puberty and produced uh, timosins, hormones that regulated T cell development and uh, lymphatic uh, here, thymus. Yes, uh, thymus uh, weighs left and right layer, lobes, uh, septum present, and uh, big pressure lobes in the structure <clears throat> and uh, histological preparate. The spleen uh, consists of these two parts, white pulp, red pulp. Uh, white pulp um, resembles a lymphoid no nodules, uh, removes antigens, uh, initiated immune response. And red, red pulp uh, contains red blood cells, uh, recycles the image of our autodidated uh, red blood cells and uh, stirs iron from uh, recycled red, red blood cells. Spleen, uh, you remember, it's a uh, organs in the ab uh, abdominal cavity connected with uh, diaphragm located near uh, st stomach, near uh, ending point of uh, pancreas. It's a uh, cow of the pancreas yeah, or tail and uh, uh, connection with uh, parietal layer of the abdominal cavity too uh, and uh, specific uh, defenses uh, it's a resistance uh, specific resistance or immunity response to, uh, to uh, threats of uh, individualized uh, basis, uh, initiated immunity, uh, uh, quite red immunity, and uh, next um, produced by prior uh, expose uh, or antibody production and uh, activate uh, active immunity and passive immunity present too. As a result, active immunity naturally uh, acquired active immunity and um, in, uh, induced uh, active immunity. Natural passive immunity and uh, induced passive immunity in uh, characterized of the passive immunity. Uh, immune response uh, purpose is uh, to inactivate it, uh, or destroy pathogens, abdominal abnormal cells, foreign uh, molecules, based uh, on uh, activation of lymphocyte by specific antigens by antigen recognition. Uh, immune disorders of uh, it's for example autoimmune disorders. Uh, mistaken attack on body on tissue, immunodeficiency disease, uh, disease or a congenital, uh, congenital block of immunity. Allergy is allergies very popular and uh, in, uh, in uh, appropriate uh, or uh, excessive response uh, to allergens and age-related loss to effectiveness. Here, for example, present uh, structure with lymph vessels, lymph nodes, uh, mm, lymphatic ducts, spleen, mm, and uh, 
As a variant of, uh, for characteristic lymph uh, organs, uh, it's a lymphatic or and immune system. Differences lymphatic system main function is to return excess tissue fluid to blood vascular system. Lymphatic vessels uh, collect tissue fluid. Immune, uh, immune system protect uh, our body from foreign uh, organ, organism. Uh, confers immunity to disease and main components it's a lymphocyte, lymphoid tissue and lymphoid organs uh, lymphatic system lymphatic system uh, lymphatic vessels collect tissue fluid from loose connective tissue carry fluid to great vein in the neck fluid flow only uh, toward uh, the heart once tissue fluid uh, is uh, within lymphatic vessels is terms uh, um, termed uh, lymph a function of lymphatic vessels collect excess tissue fluid and blood proteins uh, return tissue fluid and blood proteins to blood stream orders of lymphatic vessels um, <clears throat> first of all lymph capillaries smallest lymph uh, vessels uh, first to receive a lymph uh, in a uh, region well located microcirculatory bed uh, next, uh, lymphatic collecting vessels collect from lymph capillaries and lymph nodes. Lymph nodes are uh, scattered uh, along collection uh, vessels. Lymph nodes uh, scattered along collecting vessels. Lymph trunks collect lymph from uh, collecting vessels and lymph duct empty into veins uh, on the neck. Um, Lymphatic capillaries uh, located near blood capillaries, uh, height uh, per permeability uh, allows uh, uh, entrance of tissue, fluid, and protein molecules, and bacterial viruses and cancer cells. <clears throat> and uh, lactose specialized lymphatic uh, capillaries located in uh, the villi of the small intestine, receive uh, digested fats and uh, fatty lymph, it's a heal, uh, helium, yeah, heal. Uh, and uh, here, for example, lymphatic capillaries are uh, bl blind ended uh, tubes with vein in which uh, ejected endothelial cells uh, uh, Overlap each other, forming a um, uh, uh, flape like uh, mini valves. And flape like uh, mini valves is a place where lymph move into the lymph capillaries and next move into the lymph vessels uh, to the lymph nodes. Uh, next, uh, um, changing structure lymph in uh, this region too. Lymphatic collecting vessels uh, accompany blood vessels uh, composed of the same three tunics and blood vessels contains more valves uh, than vein uh, to help um, direct uh, the flow of blood lymph pro uh, properly by a skeletal muscle, uh, organ, uh, neural bay arteries, pulsing, and tunica media of the lymph vessels. Lymph flow. Uh, is uh, an, uh, united uh, by heartbeat uh, and uh, lymph nodes uh, cleans of the lymph pathogens. Uh, human body contains around uh, 500 superficial uh, lymph nodes located in the cervical, axillary, and in guinal uh, regions. Deep uh, nodes are uh, Trachea, bronchial, aortic, and iliac li uh, lymph nodes. And uh, generally, distribution of lymphatic uh, collecting vessels and uh, regional lymph nodes. It's uh, <clears throat> you understand well located some uh, fossa, cavity, big Persian vessels, uh, and nodes, uh, lymph nodes uh, collected in the um, uh, head, in the neck, uh, in a region uh, with uh, some fossa axillaris, axillar 
uh, nodes, yes, uh, and uh, inguinal nodes in the inguinal region. Uh, in a microscopic uh, anatomy of the lymph nodes, fibrous capsules around lymph nodes, uh, trabecal connective tissue uh, strands, lymph vessels, afferent lymphatic vessels and efferent lymphatic vessels. For example, microscopic uh, anatomy of lymph node uh, here <clears throat> with uh, some capsule next cortex uh, lymphoid folli follicle uh, subcapsular uh, sub uh, sinuses and uh, efferent lymphatic vessels. Yes, and uh, in a standard art, one or two may present, but in a standard, it's a one efferent lymphatic vessel. And uh, in a microscopic anatomy lymph nodes, for example, <clears throat> just up next, it's a lymphatic trunk. Lymphatic collecting vessels uh, converge uh, five major lymph uh, trunk. It's a <clears throat> lumbal trunk, uh, intestinal trunk, and bronchomediastinal trunks. Uh, next, subclavian trunks and jugular trunks. Uh, and this is trunk, so very important for moving all. Uh, lymph with uh, body for start and green color for lymph vessel or uh, time to time uh, used for example white color for uh, lymph uh, vessel because uh, in a lymph present big portion for uh, in a start of may present big portion uh, fat and uh, really uh, lymph uh, without color or with some mm, white color this is liquid uh, lymph ducts, uh, cisterna hili, and thoracic duct, <coughs> cisterna hili, and uh, thoracic duct uh, moving to the uh, left uh, venous angle. Immune system recognize specific foreign molecules destroyed pathogens uh, effectively, and key cells, it's a lymphocyte. <coughs> also includes lymphoid tissue and lymphoid organs. Uh, lymphoid organs, it's a lymph nodes, spleen, thymus, tonsils, aggregated lymphoid nodules and appendix. Uh, in appendix are uh, located uh, some layers in the walls of the uh, some structure. It's uh, uh, one or three uh, layers aggregated lymphoid nodules in the appendix, for example. And uh, lymphocyte uh, uh, inf uh, infectious organisms attacked by inflammatory response are effective uh, fighters of uh, infectious organism. Lymphocyte uh, T and B lymphocyte uh, are the two main uh, classes of uh, lymphocyte. Cytotoxin T lymphocytes attack foreign cells uh, directly. B lymphocytes become plasma cells, create antibodies, and respond uh, primarily uh, to bacteria and bacterial toxins. And uh, lymphocyte function T lymphocyte bind into uh, target cells proteins as uh, lizard cell membrane and signal of the diet, uh, T lymphocyte detected from uh, target cells. Target cells uh, dies by apoptosis. Uh, it's an action of uh, cytotoxin uh, T lymphocyte and uh, differentiation, uh, differentiation and activity of B leukocyte. Uh, B leukocytes gives rise to the plasma cells which created antibodies uh, antibodies bind to antigens on bacteria um, marking the bacteria for uh, destruction and antibody um, coated bacteria are uh, avidly uh, phagocytosis uh, lymphos uh, lymphocyte activation lymphocyte activation first of all lymphocyte um, destined to become T cell, uh, T cells migrated in blood uh, to the thymus and uh, development uh, develop um, immunocompetence uh, there 
B cells uh, develop immunocompetence in the red blood uh, marrow, or a red bone marrow site in the lymphocyte origin, primary lymphoid organs uh, site of um, development of immunocompetence as B or T cells, secondary lymphoid organ site uh, of antigen uh, encounter and activation to become effectors uh, and memory uh, T uh, and or B cells. Uh, next, uh, immunocompetent uh, but still naive uh, lymphocyte leave the uh, thymus and uh, bone marrow. They seed um, uh, the lymph nodes, uh, spleen, and other lymphoid tissue where they uh, encounter uh, the uh, antigen. And uh, as a result, antigen uh, activated uh, immunocompetence lymphocyte, effector cells and memory cells uh, circulated uh, continuously in bloodstream uh, and lymph and uh, throughout uh, the uh, lymphoid organs on the body. Lymphoid tissue, lymphoid tissue, most important tissue on the immune uh, system uh, or lymphoid organs, uh, two general locations, mucose membrane of digestive, urinary, respiratory, and uh, genital uh, organs. It's organs of the uh, uh, visceral organs or uh, second part of the terminology, for example, lymphoid organs, except thymus. Uh, lymphoid tissue in um, mucous membrane, uh, membrane, for example, uh, small intestine. Uh, next, uh, lymphoid organs, primary lymphoid organs in a classification. It's a bone marrow and thymus. Uh, secondary lymphoid organs, it's a lymph node, spleen, uh, mm, tonsils, uh, aggregated lymphoid nodes, and appendix. Uh, designed to uh, gather um, and destroy infection with mi microorganism and uh, to store lymphocyte. Uh, here uh, in this is figure uh, tonsil uh, in pharyngeal uh, re region. Uh, to pair, to unpair, total, totally, it's a, a six uh, tonsils thymus in a thorax, most uh, activate during uh, use uh, spleen, uh, occurs around uh, left side of stomach, uh, and uh, its region, hypochondrial left region, uh, aggregated lymphoid nodes uh, in intestine uh, appendix with uh, lymphoid uh, lymph no uh, nodules too. Thymus. Thymus uh, immature uh, lymphocyte develop into T lymphocyte, uh, secreted thymic hormones, most active in uh, childhood, uh, functional tissue, atrophies with age and uh, composed of cortex and medulla. A medulla contains hassle um, corpuscle or thymic corpuscles uh, <clears throat> and differ from other lymphoid organs function strictly in uh, lymphocyte uh, maturation arised from uh, epithelial tissue. Uh, thymus uh, in uh, old person may absent uh, because uh, change into the uh, change into the fat uh, for example in this is region lymph nodes uh, lymph nodes uh, function main function of lymph nodes it's a, a lymph uh, percolates uh, through lymph sinuses a most antigen uh, Challenges occur in lymph nodes. Antigen destroyed and activate uh, B and T lymphocyte. Spleen, uh, largest lymphoid organ, two main blood cleansing function. It's a removal of blood uh, borne uh, antigen 
and the removal and uh, destruction of old uh, or uh, defective blood cells. Site of uh, uh, hematopoiesis in the fetus. Uh, spleen uh, destruction of antigen. Uh, site of B cells maturation in uh, plasma cells. Phagocyte phagocytosis of bacteria and uh, worn out red blood cells, uh, white blood cells and uh, platelets, uh, storage of uh, platelets. Uh, right and white uh, pulp in the spleen, uh, white pulp um, thick uh, slivers uh, of lymphoid tissue, blood borne antigen uh, and destroyed as they activated the immune response provides in, in, in immune function of the spleen. Red pulp uh, surround white uh, pulp composed of venous sinuses, uh, splenic curves and res uh, responsible of for Disposing of uh, worn out red blood cells. <clears throat> and uh, um, about tonsils. Tonsils, uh, it's a simplest lymphoid organs for uh, groups of tonsil, palatine, lingual, pharyngeal, and tubal. Uh, Pharyngeal and uh, lingual, uh, it's an peer, palatine and tubular uh, tonsil, it's a peer. Together, it's a um, six tonsil in a, uh, around pharynx. Yeah? Um, arranged uh, in a ring to uh, um, together and more, uh, remove pathogens. Um, underline uh, Lamina propria consists of malt. Um, palatine tonsil structure, for example, uh, with some crypt, uh, it's a um, palatine tonsil. And a uh, big portion uh, aggregate lymphoid nodules uh, in uh, structure of the small intestine and appendix. Um, here, for example, aggregate uh, lymphoid nodules, uh, disorders of lymphatic and immune system. It's a <coughs> helothorax, lymphangitis, uh, mononucleosis, uh, Hodgkin's disease, 